Module 4, Further Assessment Several types of examinations can be carried out in the assessment clinic. There might be a physical examination of your breast tissue, as well as the lymph glands under your arms and in your neck, to see if any abnormalities can be felt. Further mammograms may need to be taken at different angles, or using magnification to provide a clearer image of the inside of your breast. If the physical examination confirms suspicions, ultrasound examination is often used, and the area can be assessed by removing some or all of it in a procedure called a biopsy. A fine needle aspiration biopsy is done in the clinic and involves taking fluid and cells from the suspicious area using a small needle. If the abnormality cannot be felt by touch, the needle can be guided to it using either mammograms taken from different angles or using ultrasound. Most small lumps are fluid-filled cysts and are not cancerous and can be removed by the needle. The fluid may need to be examined to confirm that there are no cancerous cells in it. A core needle biopsy is often more accurate for diagnosing breast cancer than fine needle aspiration, particularly when calcifications are seen. It is used in the clinic under local anaesthetic to remove a small piece of tissue from the breast and in more than 90% of cases avoids the need for surgery to confirm the diagnosis. The needle may have to be inserted into the breast a few times to get good tissue samples. If the suspicious area is too large for a core needle biopsy, or if tissue samples from a larger area need to be examined, a vacuum-assisted biopsy can be used. This involves a needle that can take several tissue samples using one insertion into the breast. Of all women recalled for further investigation, only around one in six will be found to have cancer.